Hello Smart Users, Kyle here again, and today we're going to talk about mixed reality tools for the Smart Document Camera. We're going to show you the multifaceted mixed reality features that are integrated with the Smart Document Camera 330. Mixed reality tools help teachers support multiple learning styles. This technology is available in Smart Notebook Collaborative Learning Software and uses 3D models from the Smart Notebook Gallery Collection, the Smart Exchange, and the Google 3D Warehouse. So here are some tips on using mixed reality tools with your smart document camera. Tip number one, turn on the LED light. The switch is located on the front of the camera head. Tip number two, print and use the mixed reality mat. This will increase the contrast between the mixed reality cube and background. I've put a link to the mixed reality mat in the bottom bar so if you want to follow along, you can print that now. Place the mixed reality mat on your work surface. Place the smart document camera over the darkened area on the mat. Position the smart document camera correctly. The image should show the target area in the center. Tip number three, position the document camera correctly. Rotate the bottom arm so it's at 90 degree angle from your work surface. Rotate the upper arm upwards until it's at its highest spot, ensuring the bottom arm is still set at 90 degrees. Adjust the camera head so the lens is pointed straight down. Tip number four, keep the mixed reality cubes within the range of the smart document camera. You have a large area under the document area to work with, about 14 inches or 35 centimeters from the lens. If the model transitions away from the cube, you can always reattach it by bringing it back. Tip number five, use two mixed reality cubes at the same time. The smart document camera comes with one cube, but two cubes can be used. You can purchase a second cube from smarttech.com. Mixed reality cubes must be unique and will have different pattern markers on them. Now that we've got everything set up, I have Isaac here to help me show how to use the mixed reality. Isaac, how old are you? Three. Three. And do you like dinosaurs? Do you like dinosaurs? Yeah. What's your favorite dinosaur? T-Rex. T-Rex. All right, well, why don't we pull T-Rex up on the board? First, we need a 3D object that we can insert or drag into Smart Notebook software. The file extension must be DAE, OBJ, or FBX. To insert a 3D model from your computer, just drag and drop it onto the Smart Notebook page. Now we're ready to enter Mixed Reality Mode using the Mixed Reality tools in Smart Notebook software. Isaac, show us how it's done. It's really simple. All you have to do is place the cube under the Smart Document Camera and wait a few seconds for the 3D model to transition and attach to the cube. It's just like taking a picture with any camera. You need to have the correct lighting and the model has to be within the range of the camera lens. Now that we're all ready, let's explore some manipulation features. You can use the cube to rotate the model. Or, you can also use the rotation handles on the SmartBoard Interactive Whiteboard. To rotate a 3D model along a single axis, select the 3D model and press one of the side rotation handles. Drag your finger in the direction you want to rotate the 3D model and release when it's in the position you want. To rotate a 3D model along multiple axes, select it and press the center rotation handle. Again. Drag your finger in the direction you want to rotate the 3D model and release when it's in the position you want. If you want to return a 3D model to its original setting, reset it by right-clicking anywhere on the model and selecting Reset Rotation. To reset and pause an animated 3D model, right-click the 3D model and select Animation. From there, select Play Pause Animation or Restart Animation. You can also use the magic hat to disguise a 3D model until you're ready to reveal it to your students. To do this, first hide the model by right-clicking it and selecting Disguise. You can choose from 10 different hat colors. To reveal the 3D model from under a magic hat, click the small icon in the left-hand corner. Alright Isaac, what lives in the water, has a shell, and swims around all day? Turtle. Turtle, that's right! They're a turtle! As always, make sure you hit the subscribe button above, hit the like button if you like this video and you want to see more. My last two videos should be here as well. Make sure you check us out on Facebook and Twitter. 
And as always, see you next time. Class dismissed. Hey, Isaac. See you soon.